All right, all you graveyard ship racers out there, welcome back to Under the Radar. And this week's stun of the week goes to none other than Dirk Kevin with his said stun from the video game Last Man Sitting. And it also goes to none other than Zenith BMX with his stun Sad Face Emoji Con, I guess. Once again, we don't speak wing things here. And the reason why the first stunt made it in? Well, besides injuring Bob from accounting, the ability of him actually using a fire extinguisher to grind his way up to the top of the building and spin his way on the ground was highly impressive. And the reason why we picked the second stunt? Anybody who is able to use the bottom of the Los Santos River and slingshot their way to the rooftop of a building only to barrel roll on all four wheels is incredibly incredible in our books as well. And speaking of incredible folks, I think it's time for us to get ready to rev our engines and check out a couple of these incredibly extreme tracks for another edition of the GTA Online Top 5 Tracks of the Week. And the first track that we have up comes from the creator, Udalina, or Udilemma, with their set track, UDL Turbo Land. And the reason why we decided to pick this track for this week, not only because of the crazy tubular action that you're gonna get right above the Zancudo River by Fort Secundo and by Mount Chiliad, but the fact that you have to use a little bit of skill while riding inside of these two. And what do I mean by that, folks? Well, as a little bit of a warning for any of you out there who wants to give this race a go, make sure you land on the right side of these tubes because in certain parts, it breaks off into a wall ride. And as long as you have balance and momentum, you should be fine. And if you don't, let's just say you will be visiting the bottom of the river a little bit more than often during this said race. So choose your card wisely and be careful and remember always, balance. And the next track that we have up, speaking of gaining balance, comes from the creator, Hi Hi Kabura Kabura, or Ku Kabura, with their sad track, Layers. And this track, the reason why we picked it for this week is because it looks like somebody turned a Matchbox track sideways, put it high above the city, and just told you, yeah man, go for it. And as a matter of fact, I did, and the only warning we have for you fans out there is to make sure you maintain your speed and balance during this said track. Cause one false move, and you will go back to the beginning of one of these wall riding walls that will cost you during the said race. And oh, as a matter of fact, if you try to overtake your opponent, wait until you hit solid ground, or at least one point where you're not wall riding during this race to do so. Because if you try to take him out while you're wall riding, you may cost yourself along with him this race. Unless you're a kamikaze racer who likes to see other people lose. Yeah, I got a feeling you don't want that to happen. And the next track that we have up, and a classic one just for the clown J Meeks out there. Cal Wooter with his set track, Suicide Clowns Extreme. Now, I know a couple of you at home are saying to yourselves, DJ Smokey, you've mentioned this track on the show before. Well, this one is an update from the original Suicide Clowns we mentioned last year during the Indie Awards. And the only tip of advice we have for you clown racing fans out there is to make sure you get as many boosts as possible while heading up those ramps because if you miss one, let's just say it will affect your performance as you try to make your way up the ramp and to the other side of the track, which is in gap formation, just in case you didn't know. So, like I said before, make sure you get every single ramp you possibly can. 
And oh, and thank you for reminding me, Maestro. Watch out for falling clown cars near the checkpoint near the end of the race. Because they will be falling out of the sky trying to turn around to come back for this race. Just a warning. And the next track that we have up comes from the creator Udilema or Udilema. You know what? I think it's Udilema, so we'll go with the third one with their said track UDL E A E. And this track, the reason why we picked it for this week, not only because it's a transformation race that sees you riding in probably one of the fastest cars in the game, but it's also a race filled with the most craziest loop de loops we've seen thus far this month. And the only tip we have out there for you race fans out there who wants to get this track a try is to make sure you pick the best possible off-road vehicle you can to try to take your opponent before transforming into that flash Gordon of a car to actually get a chance to win this race. Only tip we have for you. And besides that, like we would say for most of these tracks, have fun. Now we need to say that more often. And the last but not least track that we have up for this week, and I got a feeling a track you will have fun on, comes from the creator Benno AFU with his set track, AFU Construction Site. And this track that involves you wall riding on a building of all things that is under construction has to be probably one of the craziest tracks we're gonna mention for this month due to the fact that you have to wall ride and thread the needle right next to a construction crane in a building. Yeah, I kid you not when I say that. And the only tip of advice we have for you fans out there is to make sure you pick a supercar that does not have a flat front during this set race. Just in case the front of the car scoops and hits the side of a window, or at least the side of the ramp, and it costs you to race? Yeah, just in case of all of that, pick a car without a flat front. And like all races that have wall rides in them, make sure you maintain your balance while riding on those said walls. And you should be able to win this race. Just remain centered. You know, remember the advice Mr. Miyagi most likely gave you in any of the Karate Kid movies you may have seen. And if you guys want to go ahead and test out any of these tracks for yourselves, you can head on over to the Rockstar Social Club page, only known as socialclub.rockstargames.com, and search for the playlist entitled The Extreme Balance to try out these tracks plus other tracks we've added in there for yourself. And according to the Maestro, there's a high possibility for you to walk out with at least a quarter of a million dollars by the end of these races. So good luck there, Extreme Race fans. And I guess with that said for this week, folks, wraps it up for another edition of the GTA Online Top 5 Tracks of the Week. And I guess with that said, we might as well head back to this music one more time. And when we return, we'll be back with the final segment for Under the Radar for this week, right after this. So don't get lost in the madness just yet, folks, and stay tuned. 